Today, I am so excited. We are headed to Costa Mesa to see our good friend, Ryan Fisher, up at CrossFit Chalk. Learn all about his hit bodybuilding routines, how you can gain muscle, burn fat all at the same time. I've got my Organifi Gold that I'm taking before we hit the road. And come with us and find out what he's all about. Ryan Fisher at CrossFit Chalk right here on Proof. Welcome to Proof, where it's not what you hear, it's what you see. Hi, I'm Viviana and I'm on a mission to meet the most influential and talented leaders in the fitness industry. I'm going to dive deep, obtaining the best information they have, testing it myself, and then sharing it with you. There's so much information to learn and I can't do it alone. I'm Anders. For the last 21 years, I've dedicated my life to helping people live a stronger, healthier life. This journey has led me from strength coach to gym owner, and now the host of Barbell Shrug. We are bringing you inside the greatest minds in health and fitness. No more listening and reading. We want to show you. We want proof. All right, hi, I'm Viviana. Welcome to Proof. I'm here with Anders, and we are here to see our buddy Ryan Fisher of CrossFit Chalk here in Newport. We're stoked. Ryan Fisher is a madman with programming, training, all the above. Look him up on Instagram. His six pack says it all. We're stoked to be here. Uh, he's known, Anders has known Ryan for a long time. I've known him for, you know, six months now and instantly felt like he was part of the family. So we're excited to hang out with him, train with him today, get inside his head where all the madness comes from. You have a background. How do you know him? Yeah. So he walked into my gym. Uh, we got an email that there was some. Olympian, bobsledder, helicopter pilot with like all of the degrees and he competed at regionals and all this stuff and and walked Ryan Fisher and we hit it off from day one. Just super hustle, um, loved the kid and was with him when he was kind of homeless back in Pacific Beach and we've watched him grow into having one of the best gyms in Southern California and one of the best online programs in all of fitness and we're going to find out what makes it all special today. We love people that hustle, obviously, so we're here for a reason, so let's go inside and find out who this guy is. All right, we're inside of Chalk. We found yeah. our friend Ryan here. We've known him for a while. He and Yaya run their own, uh, what, do you, what do you call your podcast? Real Chalk. Real Chalk. Hence the, the name. Real Chalk. <laughs> um, so original. <laughs> He's an awesome, he's part of the crew. He and Anders have had a relationship for quite some time. Tell us a little bit about how you guys it's met. Been a where, long did time. This yeah. where did it all start? Well, I quit my job <laughs> slash lost my job because I hated it, which I think resonates with a lot of people out there. You hate your job or you really want to quit and you want to tell your boss to go fuck themselves. I actually did that without <laughs> thinking about it. And then found myself scurrying around <laughs> trying to find a place to hang out and have some friends. Um, so the first place that found that I found that also accepted me was his gym. Other people that had said, fuck <laughs> off, boss. <laughs> so um, that turned into just a cool relationship with me and Anders. And then from there, I actually, for a short period of time, four months, lost completely everything, had no money, had no um, friends that would let me stay with them <laughs> and then there was a random person in his gym who did let me stay with them and I did that for a few months um, and during that time I never really gave up on my passion which was competing and working out for time. <laughs> CrossFit Regionals seven times um, it would have been eight if I didn't get in trouble for one of them <laughs> um, top five three like times, four, three four or times. four of those times yeah. Um, fourth twice when it used to be top three, which sucked. <laughs> uh, one of those is also my fault. <laughs> if, you guys, if you guys know me, you can type in uh, Ryan, Fisher, Ryan Fisher No Rep on YouTube. That'll be a fun little five minutes for you. Um, and then <laughs> OC Throwdown, yeah. my first big day uh, in the limelight. I got second place beating uh, Blair Morrison, Nate Trader, a bunch of people who were like top 10 at the CrossFit Games that year. So a homeless person stealing food, sleeping on a couch with really no life uh, went and did that. So that's like a big reason why everything is the way it is right now. Um, and I'm super grateful for everything. I never, ever, 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 ever forget that. Yeah. After that happened, I, a bunch of opportunities happened and I got a job, which was awesome because I needed one. <laughs> I was able to eat. <laughs> I went from stealing food to buying food, um, 
And then just a slew of other things have happened since then, and I've been able to acquire this amazing gym. Um, and now the gym is known around the world in which um, a lot of gym owners actually ask me for advice and they also ask for the workouts that we do in the gym. So that happened for such a long time where people would be asking me questions about the gym um, or asking what we do in the gym that eventually I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna put my workouts online but you have to pay for them. So since the first day of my gym being open, I never put the workouts online one time. I always thought that was weird. Uh, every gym that you ever wanted to go to in CrossFit, they put their workouts online and, they were, and you could decide whether you wanted to go there or not. People would look at the gym's website, maybe San Diego Athletics or CrossFit PV, whatever it was called when you owned it. Um, people would look at it and be like, oh, that workout's meh. So they'd look at another gym that's like five miles away and that's workout, mm, it looks pretty good. Maybe I'll like that one. And then they find another one and so on, right? Sure. Yeah, which is fine. But um, I do feel like if you have you know, enough respect for what you're doing and all that, I feel like it shouldn't be free. So I spent so much time making the workouts that to put them online just seemed like crazy to me. There's an individual one and then there's a affiliate one, which is for the gym owners. There's a better flow on that one. It gets you ready for, you know, big classes of 30 people or more. Um, it also just has a better flow. Like there's, there's definitely a different skill for programming for yeah. a huge class than there is just for yourself. I mean, there's so many workouts you can do on your own that are awesome that will never work in a CrossFit like gym setting with 20 people, 30 people, different ability levels and all that. So that's all on the app. You go on the app and you can see everything. Not only that, but you can see everything I've made in the last four years. So you're not just getting a workout every day, you're getting 4,000 workouts up front and then also every workout that I do from then on. Okay. And you're getting two programs. I have a conditioning one, which is for like more endurance, uh, people who aren't very skilled at Olympic lifting. Uh, they just have the basic cardio stuff down. It's always 40 minutes in length. Yeah. And then you have your diehard CrossFit people and they have their program on there as well. That's awesome. So there's a range for people that are beginning to intermediate all the way to advanced. There's an yeah. option for them. So if I were a gym owner, I mean, I'm being set up completely. I mean, programming is You literally have to do nothing. Nothing, right. Yeah. Okay, that's awesome. So you have a hit bodybuilding ebook that you put out. So that was something that I thought was just like really, really cool. Like I, I've been at the in this game now long enough where I've had two torn labrums, I've had my, well, my left knee is actually the reason I don't compete anymore. I have no meniscus, no cartilage left in there. It's bone on bone. Technically, I need a knee replacement. Um, so getting all these injuries and all these things that have happened to me over time, I have like these like couple month periods where I won't really be doing a lot of the super hardcore right. Olympic lifting movements and all these things. Um, so I would mix in like some bodybuilding stuff, but I still wanted to breathe. Yeah. So it kind of just like, turned into like this interval bodybuilding thing. Yeah. So I would move um, some conditioning components with some traditional bodybuilding movements, like yeah. multi-joint movements, and then I just called it interval bodybuilding. And then one day I just wrote down everything I did for 30 days, yeah. and then I put it into an ebook form, and I put it online, and it fucking exploded. So I'm excited. I want you to show me a few workouts from your hit bodybuilding ebook that you have. I got so, one in mind that's gonna be really hard. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> show me a couple movements and then that way people at home can, you know, sort of see what it is and essentially either go look it up, see what it is, or they kind of take away and maybe create their own. Cool. Let's do it. Welcome to the Shrugged Collective Program Vault. Over the last six years, we've been leading the charge in online strength and conditioning programming and coaching. And for the first time in the history of the Shrugged Collective, we're combining our 11 best-selling long-term and short-term accessory programs into one membership site called the Program Vault. From Olympic weightlifting to strongman, leaning out, nutrition, you name it, our 11 best-selling programs are yours for $47 a month. Get to shruggedcollective.com backslash vault and you will find immediate access to our 11 best-selling strength and conditioning programs. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do right now with Viv is get her on the rower. She's gonna row 12 calories in one minute. She has one minute to give me 12 calories. Once she gets 12 calories, she has to come over here on the next minute and give me 10 deadlifts. So that's our two sections. So it's gonna go like this. And you go every minute on the minute, 12 calories on the row. That's gonna last for five rounds. So 12, 12, 12, 12, 12. Then you have 10, 10, 10, 10, 10 deadlifts. 
on the next five minutes. This is 20 minutes long. So 12 calories for five rounds, immediately in the 10 deadlifts for five rounds, and then all of that twice. Does that make sense? I have a question. So for your thought process, why are you not alternate? Why am I staying on You know, like essentially in a workout, most of the time it would be alternate. Why am I not alternating? Because I want you to like really, really get the breathing going, and then I really want you to get the volume in. Okay. <clears throat> so you're still going to get it either way, but it's less hectic this way, and it's actually a little bit harder. And when this is over, you will be toast. <laughs>